fate. This jewel. This is called a Magatama. It's a magical charm and it's always protected me. Done a shit job. And welcome back to Four Pixels. All your hosts are here with our guest, the Avocado from Evil Guacamole Gaming, and we are continuing Ace Attorney Justice for All. Yay! Huzzah! <laughs> See, that me. That you. That me. Hey, that's pretty out there. Whatever it was that. What's in the last episode? <laughs> it is pretty out there. <laughs> I'm, mm -hmm. I'm Phoenix Wright, attorney at law. So, what brings you here today? Murder. Uh, um. Murder. Like, so, murder, as they said. <laughs> <laughs> I mean. I was the one who told Dr. Gray about this place. He asked me, like, do you know of a good spirit medium? Hmm. Dr. Gray did say something about being introduced to this place. Cause, like, talking to dead people and, like, multiple personalities are my thing, you know? I see. Then why were you taking a nap here? Like, I wasn't feeling good. Uh, huh? I'm, like, allergic to sesame seeds. They, like, must have put some in the food they served for lunch. Oh, that... that sounds awful. Yeah, sesame seeds are delicious. So, I, like, felt sick and came in here to, like, sleep. Wow, me on Friday. <laughs> <laughs> yes, when Kime so cruelly infected <laughs> you. <laughs> I totally feel like I've wasted my time because I, like, slept a long time. So, you were sleeping here the entire time? That's your alibi? Yeah, ever since lunch. So, you don't know anything about the murder that took place? The thingy where someone killed someone else? <laughs> like, Moida. what? <laughs> oh, that. I, like, totally know nothing. So, who, like, you know killed the surgeon that requested the channeling dr gray you and dr gray knew each other right i don't know any dr gray Coughs uh, on I mean, were you coughs just on eating your hat? <laughs> Did you lose a bet? Look, it's delicious, okay? Here, try some. It does look like a pancake. Mm, it does <laughs> taste like a pancake. <laughs> <laughs> totally better than your, like, cookie badge, right? <laughs> Whoa. Considering, considering what else that looks like. No. Um, sorry, I, that that was... Uh, I stole that joke from, from Case 5. I... Four. Oh, case four. I, I, I'm sorry. I know. That was no, shameless. No, 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 let's go on. Let's not think about yeah. eating that. <laughs> <laughs> Millennial cease. That's not exactly what Dr. Gray said. Uh-huh. Um, well, uh, like, a long, long time ago, I was, like, a patient, yeah? 
sounds like she's trying to hide something. Or that she's been sniffing glue. Both. <laughs> Damn. I'm hiding that I'm sniffing glue. Like, I'm really sorry, but I'm not all that smart. So, so eat it. I don't, like, get it. <coughs> so, yeah, I'll just eat it. Hmm. Why does it feel like she's just putting on an act? Phoenix being a smart for change? Then, in, 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 uh, I forgot the word that I was gonna use. Damn it. <laughs> Tune Inquisitive? Say banner. Winding way. Inquisitive? Yeah, that thing. Thank you. There's <laughs> no one here, as usual. Ah! Uh, hey! How are you? Who was Burr again? Uh, I think that was uh, Kanetsu. Let me double check. I'm pretty uh, sure that was me. Yeah, I've got it pinned here. Or not. <laughs> if you click on it, it'll move you to, to where the pin yeah, is. Yeah, your your Pearl Kanetsu. All right. You're Pearl, right? Hey. Hmm, good talk. <laughs> Silent as ever. <laughs> Nani? What's this? She's got a key in her hand. I've seen it somewhere before. Ah. Uh... What is it? Is it my hair? Is it too spiky? Not spiky enough? I mean, with that hair, it looks like you're the murderer. Dun dun dun! Coconut spoilers. Oh shit, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was Phoenix. Phoenix was the murderer. Hold on, hold on. June 19th, Karain Village. She's probably scared out of her wits after ha having a murder take place right near her. She's Dark usually experience. further away. Oh. <laughs> Lotta? Okay. <laughs> I got to let it be me next. <laughs> if only it were. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Don't scare me like that. I have very specific ways I like being scared. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? You're the one scaring me. If I were as tough, you'd have another dead body in your hands. Mine. Oh, if only. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, there's Coco with more than Lora. <laughs> Especially for gummy worms. Yeah, <laughs> I bet she's hiding them in her fro. <laughs> the fro is fake. <laughs> it, it's a container for gummy worms. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see or notice anything that stuck out at you? Nah. Well, maybe one thing. What is it? Doors are my poor touch. Not good at handling this kind of thing. Oh, uh, what? Curses and ghosts and stuff coming back to get ya. This is too much, I say. <coughs> she is grabbing some worms. <laughs> she is. What, wait, what is too much? Bringing on a cool photographer. That's some scary stuff. So I think I'm gonna try being a celebrity photographer now. 
Going after photos is more within your reach from now on. More glamour, less gore? Oh, what's up? Oh, yeah! What, what is it? I took some... Some hot pictures earlier. Hot. Hot. Huh? Remember, I took some pictures at the murder scene inside. Ah, she did. Two even. Damn, that's a lot. <laughs> the seance? Yep. Yes. The seance murder. I sure like the ring of that. I'll be a it'll be a sensational story. When are you just retiring? But Not Lana. Now. She can make think. <laughs> Sorry, but my journalist success is burning inside me. Hate to cut and run, but I'm hitting back in. Gotta beat those cops to the scope of the century. Okay, I should laugh manically. I can't do that right now. <laughs> <laughs> or I'll die. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who's scarier, Lana or the spirits. Tough choice. And why does it feel like we've been through this before? Hmm. Wait, we have. Hmm. In a previous hmm. case. <laughs> June 19th, Fay Manor Meditation Room. Oh dear. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, madam. You have such imp <laughs> impeccable timing. Like your sips. Like, what's all the buzz? This tea. <laughs> Ooh. Ahem. All right, everyone, listen up. You too, pal. I'm going to give you all a brief update. You think of me as a pal? Of course, pal. <laughs> right now, Aww. it looks like the investigation's not going to be done until real late. That is a terrible... <laughs> shame. <laughs> I propose that everyone sleep here... <laughs> here under the roof of the Fay Manor tonight. She's been drinking a lot of tea, man. man I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna have some serious diarrhea. <laughs> <laughs> what a mess. The, not the diarrhea part, but... <laughs> I don't know, that sounds pretty messy to me. <laughs> I, oh. Well, Phoenix might not know about that. <laughs> but, depend on how bad it is, maybe he does. <laughs> what a mess. I can't believe how crazy this day turned out. Oh, yeah. Maya, Maya was arrested and taken away by the police. This old lady had crazy-ass diarrhea. <laughs> and I don't see myself getting any sleep tonight. <laughs> the, the whole matter smells. <laughs> oh, <ew. laughs> June 20. 8.02 a.m. Fay Manor Meditation Room. Uh, uh, morning. I guess I must have nodded off at some point. Or maybe he passed out because of the smell. <laughs> hey lady, when are you getting modern plumbing? <laughs> I hope Maya's okay. <laughs> I really should hurry to get to the detention center. ASAP. She's okay if she's not here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, you might be in, in jail, but you're not at the manor. <laughs> June 20, 10.34 a.m. Detention center visitor's room. Uh, I was not yet right. Mm-hmm. Nick! Nick! Hi! 
Maya. What am I going to do? I never imagined it would turn out like this. Calm down, Maya. Take deep breaths. You heard him. Come to think of it, the first time I met her, it all started right here in this detention center. I finally... I finally get to see you again, and... <coughs> and I'm dying. <laughs> it's not your fault. You didn't do it. No, I... I did it. I killed that person. But that wasn't you. It doesn't matter. It might as well have been me. I was too weak, and I... I couldn't control the spirit's power, so... I don't want to bring up the case quite yet, but... You don't have to be nice to me. I understand. So, you're the master of the something something Korean something of channeling something? Actually, <laughs> <laughs> my mother is for now. But since the titles pass from mother to daughter, I guess I will be someday. But many people think that channeling isn't real, that it's all just an act. You believe in us, don't you? Yeah, because I've seen your boobs grow three sizes. <laughs> Maya's channeling his spirit. Not only her voice, but her whole physical appearance changes. Which begs the question of why people doubt this is a real thing. Yeah. Well, I, when we get there, I, I have issues with this case because of that. Okay. It's a supernatural phenomenon that occurs every time. happened this time, too. Dr. Gray said that he wanted to call the nurse, so... Maya's body must have taken on that nurse's appearance. Once again, was more stacked than Maya. What exactly happened in the channeling chamber? I went into that room with Dr. Gray, locked the door, and sat down across from him. Okay. We closed our eyes, and I began the channeling. This is sounding kind of creepy. Like the beginning of a scary story where someone gets murdered. Nah. I wonder why. And that's the last thing I remember. What? After a spirit comes into my body, I lose myself, my consciousness. Then you don't remember a single thing. When I came to, I was being held in my aunt's arms. And there was blood all over my clothes. Hmm. Oh, but I do remember having a dream. A dream? What kind of dream did you have while you were channeling? 
Um, I can't remember it all that well, but I was dead and buried in the ground. That's a happy dream. I couldn't move, and it was unbearable, really suffocating. It went something like that. Uh, I see. I have no idea what to say to that. There was a really familiar smell, too. Under the ground? Yeah, I can't quite place it, but I know I've smelled that same scent before. I guess this is all the information I'm going to gather for today. I'll be back la later, Maya. In the meantime, please make sure you prepare it, okay? Huh? It? What is it? The document requesting me to be your attorney. Duh. <gasps> but... Uh, what's wrong? Are you sure? I mean, I'm guilty. I'm a murderer. Moira. No one's decided that yet. But I did. I killed that person <coughs> with these two hands. She's coughing. She's guilty. <laughs> <laughs> That's enough, Maya. As we all know, the guy was shot. So your hands didn't have anything to do with it. What do you it's think? It's hopeless. Go ahead. <laughs> it's hopeless. If you defend me, you lose, I'm sure. Stop it. No, no, no. Help me. Nick, help me. I'm scared. Don't worry, I will. When is the trial? Right now. It sounds like tomorrow. As usual, zero prep time. Hi, I'm going now. Wait. This you will. This is called a Magatama. It's a magical charm and it's always protected me. Done a shit job. <laughs> <laughs> Give this to Pearly, and I'm sure she'll lend you her spiritual powers. He's gonna turn a murderer too. <laughs> Sweet. I got this game's MacGuffin. June 20th, Karain Village. <coughs> I have to say, Maya, no matter what, it's her life on the line. What in the world happened in that room yesterday? June 20, Fay Manor, Meditation Room. <clears throat> the Meditation Room nurtures all mediums, young and old. Even mediums in training, I'd wager. Small mediums, large mediums. <laughs> but it's pretty deserted today. But no medium mediums. Never <laughs> Probably because of the murder yesterday. June 20, Fay Manor, Channeling Chamber. Looks like Detective Gumshoe isn't here today. Mods are away, post ponies. I should take this <laughs> chance and thoroughly check this room. If I'm lucky, I might uncover a clue or two. Oh! Mr. Wright. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, good morning. Hi! 
Hey! I'm on my way to go meet Mystic Mind. Well, drinking tea? You know, yes. after the diarrhea incident, I think you would have learned. <laughs> no, this is just a constant <sighs> state for her. <laughs> How she purifies herself. <laughs> <laughs> and all the toxins just come out. <laughs> 100% detox, some... 100% time. Sorry. Mm hmm. And I thought to bring her some items to make her feel more at home, you know, in jail. <laughs> <laughs> Namely, tea so bitter you lose your <laughs> tongue and jaw droppingly large strawberry desserts. I'm sure Maya will be very grateful. Oh, that poor jailhouse. <laughs> That mystic Maya, good sir. Ugh. She's one scary lady. Oh dear, sweet mystic Maya. Pearl wept constantly for you last night, as did I, and as did my buttocks. <laughs> 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 Weeping is was a theme for the household. <laughs> <laughs> you know it's important for me to search the site. But I should ask her some questions too, while I have the chance. Before she looks her stamp into the bathroom again. <laughs> I'd like to ask you a few questions about what happened yesterday. Do you mean that awful tragedy? The murder specifically. That man <laughs> murdered me. Oh. <laughs> so I killed him. Maya? <laughs> nice flashback voice. <laughs> Step away from that! <laughs> Please leave this area to me. <laughs> <laughs> Go quickly and inform the police. police. Train him mysterious, mysterious, mysterious. <laughs> In character, she's doing her own echo effect. <laughs> of course. <laughs> what happened here in this room after I left? First, I struck Mystic Maya on the head. To make her go unconscious, correct? To kill her! That is correct. Next, I performed the spirit severing technique. Spirit severing technique? The spirit of that nurse was inside of Mystic Maya's body. I use the technique to send the nurse's spirit back to the other world. So it's like dissociation, right? <laughs> I wonder if this kind of testimony is even admissible in a court of law. Uh, by the way, what is this room exactly? The channeling chamber. This room was created for the sole purpose of preventing such a tragedy as yesterday. Well. <laughs> it didn't work out so well. <laughs> well. What do you mean? Because it sure didn't work. Sometimes when an experienced medium calls an especially strong spirit, that spirit may become violent and revolt, as you witnessed yesterday. Revolt? But how? When the spirit enters a medium's body, she loses her will and herself steps aside. To put it another way, the spirit is bought or blah, 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 the medium's body, good sir. But isn't that extremely dangerous? An experienced medium has little problem controlling the spirit. But Maya, 
I mean, Mystic Maya. That was her first channeling on purpose. <laughs> and that was why I insisted on locking the door. However, I never thought that we... That... What? what? Oh, okay. It is an awkward sentence. <laughs> However, I never thought that would be calling danger upon the client himself. I am grateful that one of our heirlooms was not damaged in this horrible incident. And which one was not injured? My teacup. <laughs> <laughs> What is that folding screen there? It is the Korean Sacred Writings. Along with the Korean Sacred Urn, they are this village's most treasured possessions. If I ever found out that something had happened to either one... Oh, the inhumanity. Oh, the huge manatee. Odd for her to be worrying about the folding screen at a time like this. Also, it's not that secret now that it kind of, you know, I can look at it. I guess this isn't just some dilapidated old screen after all. So, how is Pearl today? Mr. Wright. Yes. In this world, Pearl is my most treasured possession. Sure, it's not that tea? <laughs> <laughs> when compared to even Mystic Maya, Pearl has the spiritual power to become a master. That's very impressive and also very possessive of your daughter. <laughs> Until now, the women of the Branch family have thought themselves to be inferior. But Pearl is different! <laughs> Her spiritual strength is so great, even greater than some of the main family! Amazing. Yes, Pearl is eternally prodigy and is the bride of the Branch family! You just hear a little trickling sound as Phoenix pees himself. <laughs> um, it's not where I thought that was going, but... <laughs> where did you think it was going? I mean, we, we've already established somebody in this room is leaky. Um... <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is a great let's play, guys. We're mature Oh, folk. yeah. <laughs> Man, quality let's play right here. We're Man, all adults. We really, we really cranked it up. Uh, <laughs> uh, wow, she is really fired up. In any case, our world is so different from yours. Perhaps it is best for you to quit, good sir. Quit? Quit what? And with that, we will end this episode right here. <laughs> Thank you guys for joining us, and see you next time. Bye, guys. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Tori, also known as Layfule. I'll say hi, I'm, I'm the person that has the art up there. That I should be working on more art, but I'm not. <laughs> I'll, I'll type in the chat. There you go. There you go. Ah, oh, shit. I'm also red like you. I need to change my cover now. I'll put my cue off. Uh, it's a normal day for me. <laughs> <laughs> you see me post sometime? I mean... Yeah. Uh, I do post so sometime. Lost. Oh, here's another post. I also, I also stream lots. I just... Hardly ever gone to Coco's stream because she's usually streaming at the same time. <laughs> Coco needs to share being so possessive. Nah. <laughs> no, Coco's more like, no, you can have this trash. <laughs> <laughs>
It's all right. We can all bathe in this fucking trash pile. <laughs> I promise, I'm not usually this funny smog. <laughs> I think I've just reached that point of tired that I'm like, I don't give a fuck. I'm delirious. <laughs> oh shit! My photography friend has got twenty percent off of something. I don't know what basic invite is. <laughs> But okay, I'm so glad that they're now sponsored. Holy shit! Holy shit. That is an amazing lust cosplay. Holy fuck. Them fingers, though. Them's not lesbian fingers. <laughs> 